I think it's interesting that we see the Lucario game one. Me I feel too. like we've seen the Pyramithra game one more often than not recently. Kels, we were talking about it uh, when we previously were talking about why Lucario against Pasha, and uh, or uh, sorry, Pyramithra against Pasha. You specifically mentioned this matchup, and you were like, "This is one of the main reasons why Pyramithra came out for for Armadillo." So uh, I'm glad that we get to see a little bit of confidence with Lucario at least game one. And if it goes south. You still got you still got the duo, man. You for a reason. Hey, yeah, man, when you are doing that, an what opening like that, death on the board here, and you did say like the body each other back and forth. Well, that was definitely a body on the side of Sore. Yeah, oh, but what? now the rebuttal coming in from Armadillo, his turn. But never mind, Sore not giving it to him. Really, his turn, as you said. I mean, <laughs> he's got oh, attitude, right? He's gonna back it up it. with his own play style here. Just oh. amazing. Oh, You're going to need all the help from Aura right now, Polar. Doesn't even get a chance to use it. Dude, I got to say, I mean, maybe I've got a little tiny bit of bias in the back <laughs> of my head, but I feel like in the previous sets, Armadillo's been a little bit shakier, and Soar, Soar with confidence is a top 100 player in the world, but Soar, when he's not feeling himself, that's when he really starts yes. to crumble. So mm. Armadillo just kind of got to put his foot down, which is looking like what he's doing. Gets the answer, finally putting a stock on the board. Is he able to slow down the crazy fireball momentum that is sore right now? Well, that's as you mentioned before, like when you were asking, who do I think is going to win? Obviously, I think either of them can kick shut his butt on any given day. But definitely today, I feel like, even though it was not easy feat to get here, I feel like Sore had the more of a breeze coming through, just plowing through his previous opponents, where Armadillo was giving a little bit of a trouble here. Oh, oh my god! god. That's a thing. Did you what? see that? I have never seen that from any Steve ever. The soft hit of that second hit of the down air into the back air from Diamond, the reverse part two. That was so clean, and that was definitely true. That was amazing recognition, gross. right? That, yeah, that was, was amazing recognition because you want when you footstool Anvil, you're thinking, okay, I'm just gonna launch him, get off of me. I'm gonna go grab some, grab some more materials while you're gone. He said, oh wait, that was weird. I got the second hit. <laughs> Back here, this. Yeah. yeah. Well, Rory, I, I doubt you care to lab something like that, but I'm sure, again, his reaction speed is phenomenal. Oh, yeah, amazing. I mean, especially when you're playing shooters like Valorant. <laughs> you know, we were talking about that. Stay on the reaction, baby. Click the head. But yeah, I'm he always technically back here in the head. <laughs> he <laughs> did, he yeah. did click the head. No, but I just got to be, I, I'm still always scared for Soar because, like I said, he gets one doubt in his head. And suddenly you're just looking at a completely different player. I feel like it's so, both of right? them, though, right? Like, we've seen Armadillo yes. on stage internationally look like he's about to crumble. And it's the same with Soar. Exo, you look like you want to say yeah. something as well Yo, about I that. I want to mention something I think is really important that I've noticed from Soar's gameplay right now. He only got one stock off with Diamond. With the, yes. other, with the other tools, he touched him. He killed him. He made sure <laughs> I'm not going to take any time to mine. He's like, the one opportunity I get to avoid Aura, I'm going to kill him. If you go back to those two first stocks, it wasn't zero to death combos. It was zero to death strings. But he was like, I'm going to take the 50-50, and I'm always going to pick the option that will kill. Because if it does, it'll sway the game in my favor heavily. And it did oh, that's more it. than anything. There's definitely moments in Smash mm -hmm. where you have an option between choosing uh, oh him and never mind, oh, just choose one. to kill him. You have the option of choosing to take the more damage or potentially go for the kill. Against Lucario, that answer should always go for the kill. Yeah, you're building Aura? Oh man, let's <laughs> let's end that idea really quick. Something that I've really noticed in general about Sora specifically, such a different mindset going into this, he just like, has everything on point. You know, his combos are connecting, his follow-ups. Yesterday, he was saying that it didn't feel like that. And today, yeah. it's like, it's much better. I don't know what was in that breakfast this morning in the Gil Bazaar restaurant, what? but it is working. The man can really <laughs> hit it across, and it is going down, because no matter what you're putting out, whatever oh. or you got, you are finally going to get hit on the edge. I'm going to pass scared. the mic now. Yo, <laughs> Could, could we just mention the fact <laughs> that he just I've smashed through the the, the thing quite baseball. possibly the largest aura sphere I've seen in my life. That's the power <laughs> of diamond right there. Yes, sir. And he clanked to you, and nothing, nothing beat the other cleanly. It just <laughs> clanked. Yeah, there was no lag either, right? Like, he kind of hit it and was like, okay, let's move on. Oh, my God. That was so beautiful. That's the 2 like nil grab. That's like the only character that can grab on a platform because he can create his own just below it. Yeah, but I love that recognition Bye. to go for that. The spacing, too. Also, the timing on that is pretty hard because if you mess that up, you actually press grab while you're in the air. You have to press your block button as you're right above where the second block would be. Mm-hmm. Okay, now, I mean, he has such a strong opening, but if we really look at it, I mean, Armadillo brought this back. Now, not only is it such a great factor 
from Lucario as a skill point, what? but I mean, it's really just a, a testament here that Armadillo is not <laughs> someone. <laughs> Bye, I'm going outside to play in the park. You can stay right inside. It's raining. Bye. <laughs> like another another day coming in here. I mean, Exo, what do you think this difference is? Why do you think Armadillo is struggling a little bit more than usual? I, I genuinely think it's just Sora picking his spots very well. I, I think that, like, he realizes, hey, I don't need to mine too much. He's not putting up that many walls. Look, he's mining in his face. Every time that he's mining, I feel like it's more of a bait than anything. Right. Because he wants to take advantage of Armadillo overextended more so than just straight out winning neutral against him. Because he knows, hey, like in a situation like this, you got no rage whatsoever. Even if you get your filthy hands on me, Often overcommit, you won't do wow. much. You died. Beautiful you died counter, at 50, though. by the way. You yeah. died. We saw him do that before, actually, using the advantage of the Lucario's counter to actually counter the minecart. Usually it's when he pops out anyways, mm. and he'll still target Steve anyways. But that time, he was still in it, so he was a sitting duck. Yep, exactly. Yep. I also, well, I want to mention Armadillo kind of not phased by sore mining, as you mentioned. He's kind of just letting him mine in his face, not even really putting any mm. pressure. He said... You know what? You're gonna get the diamond anyways. I'm just gonna fight you with it. Oh, and you that's know, it. Oh, really? That's it. That was beautiful. Oh, you're beautiful back. Living. Beautiful, beautiful living. A beautiful living. Beautiful living, yeah. beautiful guys. Beautiful living. I was, that was living. <laughs> I was gonna say barely living and beautiful. On counter and city, as you would say. Count <laughs> oh my god. It's tough to say. Yeah, we feel like we've been touting for obviously oh, Soar doing so phenomenally, but somehow Armadillo sucked through. I thought the advantage state was in Soar's favor the entire time, but here we are at Lucario's windscreen. You know how earlier you said when you are playing against a Lucario, if you have the opportunity to damage and kill, you have to take kill? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's why I ended up losing Sora that game. Right. Because he got, he got a jab and he could have easily done a turnaround back here with Diamond, put him in the corner, 111%, he wouldn't be dead. However, he had gold minecart. Which is I think he just got really excited. Honestly, he, he got. I think Sor got excited. He had such a yeah. strong first kill, right? Okay. Especially with the extension after yeah. the stage, getting the bear. But uh, the minecart would have killed. But, like, I mean, but he just overextended. Exactly. And when you know, when you're a top player, you try to understand what killed me. Okay, this yeah. did. So there was no way it was gonna get hit again by the same thing. Ever since that one counter and then brought it back. I mean, I mean that put Armadillo right back in the game and told mm -hmm. Sor, hey, don't sleep on me. Don't get too excited, bro, because I'm a, I'm a beat you for it. More Lucario, by the way. More Lucario. Yum, no pyro on the throw. I'm okay with that. It's interesting, too, because we actually saw that Smock actually sometimes favors the pyro in this matchup. We already know that Armadillo has a proficient uh, Aegis as well. It's surprising that he's not trying that against him yet. Yeah, I mean, the Lucario's been working, and I think you mentioned it, too, Exo, where you were like, Armadillo's kind of picking his battles, and that's what it looked like he won him that game, too, was like, I'm going to let you mine. I don't care. I'll let you do your thing, but eventually I'll get the hits that matter, and that's what kind of, you know, you, oh, wow. And that's oh, the trap we were talking about there. The it's not a safety net. It's actually a setup. You get no invincibility while landing on a platform. That's a free F smash or an up smash yeah. or a down smash, if you'd like. You that handle, setup started you want. deep. From the blocks he started, he knew Armadillo would be smart enough to go all the way to the right to do it, which gave him a predictable up to get two frame. That was a long drawn plan. Sword just knew what Armadillo was going to do. And it feels like this is the story of this game currently. Looking like the first one, honestly. Yeah. Wow. Ooh, that like back that here is definitely gonna knock you out into the blast zone, though. I mean, and what looked so close and that you looked so healthy, we always forget that that back air from Lucario, like, kind of really makes quite the punch. And now he's on his way, just like the last game. Coming back here, I mean, the damage is racking up, and I feel like Soar is the one who is pressing a little bit forward more than usual, and he's actually gonna lose the stock wow. for it. At like 70%, that back air, you're still not safe, and I love that Armadillo keeping up the pressure breaking his crafting table in his face while he's trying to use it. No diamond on board. He's got wood when it's your last stock. Wow, he, he can't knew. craft this diamond. He's you getting there now. My he house? Gets it okay, there. I'm coming over. He's got his own brand of aura. It's also blue, surprisingly. Go for it. <laughs> Even Limit is blue. Arsene's blue. Maybe is blue is just the, that's just the good color. color. I like blue. I like blue. Blue, yeah. Blue or red? Blue. I do like blue. You know, the, the holy what? No, it's not actually quite as strong as Ew! Ooh. What if you are kind of godlike, okay? Only the mind, you know the young minds he, can He's do done it. that so many times. Oh, <laughs> he yeah. didn't even just parry it. He knew that he's Lucario so would bounce, and he chased him for it. He's so good at that. <laughs> that is that is what happens when these two players have fight, fought each other so many times. I'm just so nervous for both of these players. This early stock matters so much. Yeah. Oh, tried the, tried the MBC, but I think that was weird. I messed up a little bit because Armadillo yeah. rolled into the block. Okay. 
again back into neutral, trying to find landing. And all one's turn, that spot dodge, and also oh. facing the wrong way is going to get the reverse back air there and setting up these blocks, making it hopefully a little bit harder to recover. But no, the big ball is ready. Mm. Not going to be phase out sore, though. Yeah, both players have their gimmicks, their trump cards, their great oh, equalizers hey, on the deck right now. Oh, okay. such an awkward scenario. What is happening? <laughs> we love the <laughs> That's it, folks. <laughs> You just got to be careful oh as both goodness. players. Armadillo waiting for the mic cart, waiting Ooh. for the jump. Ooh. Waiting for the side special from Soar as well. Yeah, right? exactly. Yo, I'm so scary. Lord's been the block. Yeah, 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 yeah. How does he know? I'm good. Oh, oh my god. god. Again. He fell for the same trap again. Like as you mentioned, Soar is not a character that player that uses Minecraft very often, but the few times he has, Lucario has capitalized on it. Wow. Oh, wow. And I think it's also like... He didn't have gold, and it makes minecart way easier to react to when you yes. don't have gold. It was so slow too, right? Exactly. Like you already hit a wall, so the minecart looked like it was just kind of on a slope, like no gold. Too, right? cruise. <laughs> yeah, I, that's it. I need to ask something though. When you know when you land, there's the the rails that get put under under yeah. your minecart. Can you still jump out the moment you land, or no? I, I think there's a bit of a delay because I think that might have been what caught him. I think he might have been trying to bait it out and jump out, but because yeah. he landed, he couldn't anymore. You Maybe could tell that, that he definitely he was baiting greedy. it. Yeah. I, I'm pretty sure Sora was baiting the the uh, the counter, but I think he couldn't actually air dodge enough in time. He got exactly. out, but he couldn't put in that air dodge fast enough. Yeah, he definitely jumped out last second, but it just wasn't fast enough. Yeah. So now we're back here again. I mean, every single time Sora has had a lead, but hasn't been able to really keep it because of Lucario and because of Armadillo's adaptation that he's using here on the fact that Sora is just holding forward. And it's a big problem that's really coming back to bite him in every game so far. And there you go, up tilt back here, a little bit of stage control. Go for that. Whoa, I love the counterplay to the TNT up tilt setup. Oh, oh. Uh, almost wow. not a counter, but okay. Bit that was TNT for a long time. Uh, <laughs> TNT was kind of falling asleep there. Yeah, the TNT does take really long to Oosh. blow up. I think Armadillo knows the timing. He's fought Steve enough. Mm -hmm. Oh, that minecart kind of giving up his stage control. That was really weird. I think this is tense, and we all know it. We're yeah, we're all quiet, guys, because it's just like it's a moment of truth, okay? This is a big day. Oh, he built it untackable and killed off the mm. top. Mm. Mm. And now we got a serious situation. I'd say every Lucario's dream, especially being up those two games right now, we have Steve at 0% and Lucario with a ton of aura on deck to make some gravy happen. Yeah, especially only stone, so you're not too, too threatened. And you still have that 142 aura. The down smash still not killing. Yo, so like was baiting a back air there. Ah. He was placing blocks, but he was nilling oh. them so he could shield. Unfortunately, he gets the spike part two of that sp of that affair. So 196. I haven't okay. seen Armadillo live this long in so long. It's the first time he has a lead, by the way. So this is really not the ideal situation that Soar wow. wants. And the back that was just a free yeah, jump crawling back down as well. the, the crawling down the stage with a huge aura sphere. Finally takes it. Never mind. What? This is a very scary situation. Finally! There you go, the dash attack. Gonna 22. kill at 200. He wants to crash when he's next to the TNT. <laughs> and this is honestly still a scary situation for Armadillo. Even with that one stock lead, you do actually get, gain aura slower since you are up a stock, I believe. True! Right? I'm not making that yeah. up. That is true. Yeah, okay, yeah. You true. do have less, a bit less aura if you're a stock above, and vice versa. If you're a stock below, you get a bit more aura at the start. Too. But if you follow to It's uh, kind of like you add or give 30% kind of thing. Yeah. yeah. This could be actually an opportunity, though, for Sora, right? Like, he doesn't mm. have to really worry mm. so much about getting all the weapons! Oh, oh my god! Everybody oh my god! god. What Are just happened? Kidding? But those cancels, knowing when your block was going to actually come apart so you can carry on and use that momentum to take those stocks was an actual oh my God. genius. We're back. Oh, my Christ. Name Someone, me. He wants this game five so uh, bad. Name me a character that could spike after up smash. Yeah, yo, this is why you we know? like Millie. That was insane. That was a, that was absolutely incredible. Wait. The wherewithal to even know that was it's coming not out. over. Oh, oh, the background no. on the mic card. He's still living. It's not over, You're though. Bad. TNT, the Goodbye, stall, TNT. losing a lot of materials. Yeah, he gets back to the stage at this point. He doesn't have a lot on deck. Oh, the dash tag barely going to be at the back here. It. It's going to take it. And Armadillo moving on to grand final.